I apologize in advance. It is very windy here on the back of the Intrepid, but we are intrepidly still trying to talk with as many builders and users as we can, which is why I am here with Tenel, also known as Jeremy, who's a scripter on Roblox, and we are going to talk about that. So, you told me when we first met that you're primarily into scripting. Although I don't really want it to be primarily scripting, and just another one of my um, talents, it, 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 it is pretty, it's one of my uh, best things that I'm good at on Roblox. Right, and I think uh, what a, a lot of users kind of see Roblox as such a broad platform that they just kind of focus on what they're naturally good at. Right. You know what I mean? And then they kind of like go big picture and try to be like more, more rounded yes. out. Has that been your experience so far? When I, uh, when I started playing Roblox, I, I just started playing games and stuff and then I just started building obstacle courses by myself and it, I was like, hey, this, and I was, I was looking at um, uh, lava scripts and I was like, hey, this is pretty intuitive, uh, the Lua language is very nice. And I just kept on experimenting with Lua and I became better and better at it. I've also, as also with building and whatnot, I, I watch other people build and I tried replicating other people's creations and I and I started becoming better and better at building and I continue to learn from the building experience. Uh, great answer. Uh, let me ask you this, like a lot of our users have seem to have moments of kind of like zen where they kind of like a big aha moment, you know? Like yeah. something happens, they recreate something or they see something. Did you have a moment like that ever? I I, I recreated a uh, a while ago, I recreated a game that was abandoned. It was created by PyDude777. It was a game where you had a pickaxe and you mine um, ores, like stone and ores and all that. And I, re I recreated it because it was abandoned by him, who, who quit Roblox abruptly. And I continued to work on it. So you wanted and to finish when you started, right? Yes. Uh, interesting. Um, did you participate in the hackathon? Yes, I did. And I, it looked to me as if I was one of the only ones, if not the only ones, who was, who, who was actually uh, doing the scripting hackathon. Although I kind of did want to do the building hackathon, it would be too much for me to handle. So you focus primarily on scripting then? Somewhat, because there's less competition on, on the scripting side of the hackathon. Well, not only that, but the scripting is, is is what I'm really passionate about, and that's that's pretty much who I am on Roblox. So, what is we've, we've mentioned this numerous times at this point? What is the most complicated thing you scripted? That's a very hard question. <laughs> I a lot of a lot of scripters on the scripters forum and anywhere else, they instead of creating actual games that a lot of people would like to play and hit the front page, instead they they create a lot of tech demos where they demonstrate a lot of things. Say it be from um, A star pathfinding algorithms or 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 dice, which is made by Blocko. I've seen one the other day. Uh, there's there's a, there's a bunch of stuff they made, but I don't really do that. I I I, cr I basically um, I, I although I usually am not successful yet. At least I am I I constantly create new things. They may not be practical, but they are. Um, a, a learning experience, so I don't have anything I could have uh, bragged about for its complexities. Although I could say that um, I've figured out a lot of uh, a lot of algorithms for for ray casting and stuff, and I'm and I'm going to do more of those challenges for algorithms in the future. Awesome. Well, listen. Uh, best of luck to you in the hackathon. Um, we're gonna have the numbers, you know, a couple days out, just like right. normal. So uh, I'll be sure to keep your keep your name in mind when we're sitting through the numbers. All right, all right, man. All thanks right. for talking to me. All right, thanks.